What's going on guys, it's Leafy Murdoch here and here today with chapter 121 of Attack on Titan. So yeah, let's get straight into it. So, we get to find out a lot of things in this chapter regarding the uh, founding, title, fi founding Titan and Attacking Titan like powers and that sort of thing and going forward what this means and stuff and seeing what happens maybe in like during the um timeline and stuff but yeah like things that happen now that m happens in the past sort of thing you'll get what i mean in a minute so we're in the cuff still of like um seek and Aaron debating amongst themselves um whether or not to go out with seek's plan or to go with Aaron's plan and he Seek ask Aaron, what do you intend to do with the founding titan's power? As I, I, ever since I was born, I've been me. What's been pursued, what's being pursued is freedom. I've used to think you and I were the same, but I was wrong. In other words, if other people are going to steal my freedom, I'm going to steal theirs. Father did not intend on them that happened to me. I've always been that way ever since I was young. Jesus Christ, there's a lot to impact in this chapter, but I'll try and keep it as condensed and as discussionable as possible. But he says to seek, Aaron says to seek, the fake little brother you wish for is nowhere to be found. Neither is the little brother who lives in the perfect circumstances to be able to share your emotional wounds. The only person who can be found here is a man who foul his confidence only by continuing to deny his father's desire to restore Eldia, a pathetic man who is a slave to his dead father. So he's pretty much like a slave to his dead father's like, you know, plans. Well, like regardless, like, yeah, you kill know I me. Mean? I don't know really how to describe it. <laughs> so, but if that's the case, this man should be thankful to his father. That father's actions opened his eyes, son's eyes, and saved the world from the crisis of Eldia, says Seek. That in a sense, the one who saved the world is that father. Don't you think it's ironic, Aaron? And we get a lovely shot of like, Aaron um, putting the scarf over Misika's face, because they're in a flashback where Misika, I can't say her name, I do apologize, <laughs> Mikasa or whatever. Misika um, is putting a um, like scarf over her face, and I don't know why. I feel like the art has like really like stepped up his game. All the dudes do writes this. I can't remember his name off the top of my head, but has really stepped up his game for this chapter. And like a really nice shot of Eren and Misika Mikasa or Miss Mikika. I can't Mikasa. I was called Mikasa. I do apologise if that's name wrong, but it's a really nice shot of her. And just seeing like loads of flashbacks and all of that stuff and the instruction to where Aaron goes in this announcement to his father and mother that he wants to be um a part of the a part of you know um part of the attack on Titan <laughs> core. So we get to go back to the um Ritz family when uh, Aaron's dad um, attacked uh, or killed the Ritz family, basically, except the father. He basically says, the people who live in these walls have no idea about the crimes their ancestors committed because you stole their memories. Do you think it's simply, that simply being eaten by titans without knowing the reason why is supposed to be some sort of atonement? No matter how much, and then she says no. No matter how much we reflect on the matter, we're unable to bring back the alien lives that have already been taken. However, the lives of people outside the walls be taken is something we're able to avoid. If we simply form a fine ignorance and accept the wrath of this world, ourselves and people will die, and that will be the end of it. And pretty much, then he uh, says that the attack, the attack, attack Titan can see the future, or the founding Titan. I do apologise. Can see the future. And then he goes on the floor, 
And he says, I will devour your, the fat foundling titan and wipe out the royal blood. There is the feature which I have decided. And then Grisha stabs his hand, doesn't really work out very well. And then Eren talks to uh, Grisha and says like, oh, you just go forget about what's happened to your sister, your mother and your father and that sort of thing. And yeah, it influenced him to basically go full on the attack on Tyrant mode. And then yeah, he does and then it happens. What happens before, like, you know, what's happened before in like season two, I believe, happens and then he comes out. And then funny enough, um, Grisha and Seek have come together and they actually see each other and they and they finally see like well Grisha sees um Seek as an adult and he says I'm sorry for what I was done and stuff and like all the terrible things that I've done and like the path I sent you down and he's a terrible father basically what he's done in the past. Seek I love you. I wish we could have spent more time together. Dad Seek stop Aaron. So yeah, he's ta- I don't, I, it's a bit confusing like, what's going on in the scene, but it seems like he's telling Seek to stop Aaron, and then they go back into the uh, other world that they were in, you know, with like Ymir and that sort of thing. You made it so Dad would fight against the king of the wolves and the world. Is that what you did? If they attack, if they attack on Titan's ability to this first time, it would be possible to influence the past by only sharing Grisha's memories convenient for you. Grisha was hesitating over his duty as a restorant because he, having seen your memories, he knew that only if you stole the Fountain, he, fountain, he would have been able to use that power. But he was made to steal that Fountain by you. I saw it four years ago throughout my father's memories. I saw my memories from my future. That's scenery. So you can probably see the future and he probably knows maybe what's going to happen or stuff, or stuff like that. Who knows? We'll have to still find out like what can happen. So then basically Seek takes the weak version or takes the weak way out. Says, Found you more. Take away from all the Ymir subjects, their ability to reproduce. So yeah, they must mean the aliens. I like to do it in my own voice. Take away the earth from earth, you... <laughs> Take away all from earth of Ymir subjects, their ability to reproduce. <laughs> God. Then Aaron breaks free and then he says, then Seek says, it's useless. It's useless, Aaron. No one in this world has been able capable of stopping the founder of Ymir once he moves. God, I hope that God that it, this doesn't like turn into a story where like everyone gets euthanized and everyone has no ability to give re- to reproduce. Seek some. Oh God, what a bad, what a bad idea, and just like a self-loathing. I don't know. Just don't like it. Really don't like it. Another reason why we've got to wait another month. And the creator has uh, done it again. He's made us want to wait another month for uh, Attack on Titan Chapter 122. Which obviously will be coming out next month. Man, this story keeps getting... Oh, I don't... I kind of don't like it. But for good reasons. Like, oh, I don't... I don't, I don't want... I don't want people to get euthanised. Or like not have the ability to reproduce or anything like that. I really don't want that to happen. Um uh what we still we could still be in this portal to um like world type thing. Once we come back, we'll see. It's such a lonely world. Such a sad world as well. They um the air in the seeker are in and it's very interesting to see like Seek was is basically able to be there in like physical form and was Grish- was that a part of Grisha's plans in the past for this whole thing to happen we're not sure who knows 
we'll have to find out and see wait and see anyway guys thank you for watching i do apologize for the call to the background i literally have nothing else to put up else in the background and it is quite late at night so yeah anyway guys thank you for watching and i know i'm not very good at this give me a break anyway <laughs> love you all see you next time peace